Hello and welcome back, my name is Andrei and I'm Dominika and we're back again with another reaction to Stevie Ray Vaughan and Double Trouble with Crossfire All right All right uh, Robert, this one is from you, thank you very very much Thank you Stevie Ray Vaughan is not completely new to us, we've done a few of his songs This is the man or musician who is absolutely feeling the music with the whole body, with every cell in his body and I remember watching him performance is such a pleasure so i'm very excited to check this one out i'm ready too i mean like you say it's not much to say about it already yes. we kind of know everything so yeah. ready mm -hmm. let's go <laughs> Okay, we stopped <sighs> just at the beginning. Most probably gonna be the, the solo now. Um, I go back. Here we go. <laughs> Whew, okay, I'm having so much fun listening to it. Uh, I did ha have a little look at the lyrics before we started because on the live shows you don't always hear them very, um, very clear. And I, straight away, I absolutely love the lyrics. Uh, and funny thing is that you definitely can apply them to the, today's world as well. Um, as to the world where Stevie was still part of. So um, nothing changes. It makes you sad, really, when you think about it. But then his performance put a smile on your face, so it's kind of outweighed the, the sadness. Uh, I absolutely love it. The sound is straight away. You know who he is. You know who's, what's going to happen. And you can, you, you just, the whole body reacts to him. Are you all right? Yeah. <laughs> You're a little bit shy. I know, no. I mean, you know, I'm so excited. The thing is it... It, it's such a legend when he go and grab the microphone and yeah. starts singing that voice and come out and it's so imbattable. No one, um, can, I don't know, is a word probably. Is maybe it if it's not imbattable, I don't know. <laughs> well, I, maybe I messed it. Unforgettable. Oh, well, kind of. All right. Yes, you're right. <laughs> I don't, probably. I don't, maybe you're right. I no, just... I think you're right. <laughs> but you know what? The songs just started and he go there and he, you see him, all his body start to move yep. and he, how he feel the music. And that's why I say, I don't know if anyone like him like that. Yeah. He just have that thing in his, with, connected with the music. And I do love his voice so much. And yeah, like you say, we stopped right probably before the, the solo. The solo, yeah. That's our one, it's something that I want to yes. kind of uh, really see. But you know what, this guy is a, such a legend, honestly. It's definitely gone to some, well, who didn't? But mm. it, it that does make you feel sad thinking about how tragic his end was. Um, really, really sad. But amazing. Oh yeah, I went back, go. Ready? Yes.
I want to quickly add oh, that that last part. I wish it was a little bit longer. I, I want to add the harmony and the relationship between him and the Double Trouble or the rest of the musicians is absolutely amazing to to watch and you, you can hear it straight away. The sound is perfect. I want to, that's what I wanted to say. You know what, when, when we were checking about the song and we were checking <clears> the lyrics, I was like, oh yeah, I'm going to be taken back by the lyrics. And sometimes it is like that, that the song takes you because of the lyrics and because mm. of the message. Which a message, all the message in uh, all the lyrics are very close, uh, very close to my heart, <laughs> and uh, to kind of the but my you, philosophy you can of apply. life. Yeah, that's correct. But when he starts to play, the mu the music takes over the lyrics. Mm. It's not that I forget about the message in the lyrics, but it's just music. It's so so mm. grabbing me so so much more than the lyrics in this case. But I want to focus a little bit on the uh, lyrics itself and. It's not necessarily I'm in a position to give anybody advice, absolutely not. But this is something that it was happening to to us a little bit when we were before we decided to come to Romania. If we were in that cycle, you know, you you making money, you going to work, you spending money, you, mm -hmm. and it's again, you know, the cycle cycle was repeating. And again, I'm going to say that I have nothing against people who work hard and making money and and spending the money they work hard. That's not what I'm saying. It's just for me personally, it was a little bit too much. It was a little bit overwhelming for for us both, I believe. And we decided we cannot. We don't want to live like that anymore. We don't want to be, you know, having nine to five job and and. Uh, and kind of the, the living in the city was a little bit overwhelming as well. So we decided to to change the break the cycle. Yes, we have less money. That's correct. But at, at the same time, I think we have more time to spend together and share and doing the things we absolutely love. Uh, and one of these things is uh, actually what we're doing in here. Because when we were working full time, we weren't able to do the videos every day. We weren't able to, um, you know, to spend that much time. Mm -hmm. That's and uh, and uh, you know for that I'm very very grateful that we are able to do it and I think that's what everybody needs to find in life you know their own balance whatever mm -hmm. it's don't chase after something that you know someone else is telling me uh, telling you that mm -hmm. you have to do or you should do in your life just chase after something you want you really just stop and think and what is really important to you and go and grab it with mm -hmm. two hands that i think that's what you're right you know we talk so many times uh, life is so short it's just a blink of an eye yeah you you even say uh, a few days ago we've been talking and say is it me or just i have impression that they go so fast the week goes so fast it's yeah. just like it was monday it's sunday and it's just and it's true i mean I don't know. I think the older you get, uh, time fly faster in a way. Yeah, that's correct. And then you know, you feel the kind of the breath on the back mm. of your neck that it's like it's getting closer and closer mm. and and, and staying close to the loved one and the family I and that's... do more things. I mean, yeah. probably a lot of people. It's, it's like you say, going working all day not seeing the kids, not staying home yeah. with them. They're growing up and then you, you just, it's so many things you lose in life. But in a way, is this the cycle? If he was thinking about this back in the days, it's still the same thing. These things never change. We are yeah. kind of trapped in this kind of thing. And it, it's, yeah, in a way, you know. And you know what? There are, there are a lot of people that doing this kind of lifestyle because they want to provide for the family. Mm. They want to give them comfortable life. They want to leave some legacy for their child. For yeah, for their children. They want to build a house. They you know they want to have this comfortable life and gives what's best. But there is also a majority of people these days they've been fed with all this. You have to buy, spend, spend, spend. You know the mm. things we don't need. Mm. I understand everybody wants to have a house and live in their own house and all that. And that's beautiful. Yes, you have to work probably to get that. That um, there is no other way mm -hmm. to do that but when you start to overspending when you when you start thinking oh i need to work more to get more the things you're not going to need in few months or few years you know it's it, it's that's the cycle it's like a hamster chasing so and you're never gonna on the mm -hmm. wheel you know and mm -hmm. you're never actually actually gonna get anywhere because it's just well it's, i think it's always like that the yeah, more you do so. you still want more is it you you it's so hard probably sometimes to put that uh, stop it's a balance till here yeah. and uh, you know to, to make it's really hard i'm so sorry it's really hard to let go that no. that because it's yeah, really exactly. really yeah. hard to let go. once you in it in that machine and it's also there is a lot of mechanism making you feel like you cannot stop that cycle mm -hmm. even at work i had absolutely amazing work when when i was living in uk i loved my work so so much but they got to the point that i thought I was, they made me feel, I was irrepla irreplaceable, that people was gonna, if I leave, what's gonna happen? I have to be there 24 hours available. Without me, everything's gonna fall apart. 
bullshit nothing fell apart after I left they forget about you <laughs> they forget about me it's just I was just the yeah the tool <laughs> and it is like that you it is at the workplace you're a number that's all it is you know you might love your job and that's great I definitely makes your life a little bit easier but at work you are but love more, more your family probably. yes I, I would say out, outside of the work have a little bit more life anyway that was the, the lyrics kind of took me there but uh But this, the song itself and the, the, the last part when he was just getting into it, just, it was really hard to stay on your seat, wasn't True it? True that, you know, the, you say about, oh, it's uh, the lyrics, it's the song, it's his voice. You know, I think what he give, it's so much on yeah. a plate in one, because he have everything up to the standards yes. like that. Then yes. you, 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 yeah, you focus on lyrics, but then you say, oh my God, he have such a voice when he starts to sing. He's going that bluesy kind of with his voice rough <laughs> like that and then the, all the band is just they go nuts with the instruments and it's that is such what's, a complete exactly what's beautiful about him that he feels he seems very natural with, mm-hmm. in what he was doing and is i it, think that's why it was so effortless mm-hmm. not easy by no means but effortless it's like he's in his own skin that's how he's Element, supposed yeah. to, yes exactly and i think that's what's so beautiful about him but that's all the time that's the, the, the vibe you get yeah I mean, it's just it's cool. just do it like All right, I'm the trouble, double trouble now. Yeah. <laughs> all right, hope you enjoy our reaction and see you again next time. Have a lovely day and all the best. Take care. And if you stay till the end, <laughs> this is switch off in my speech. Then thank you very, very much to all of you. Well, to all of you who are watching. Uh, thank you so, so much. I think you always have to say this on the beginning. Uh, not many people stay till the end. All right, I don't know. We'll see. All right, bye-bye. Bye for now. Can I stop it now? Here you okay. go.